Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's King Vita here, and I'm back with an unboxing video. And today we've got a special unboxing from Controller Chaos here. So let's get this unboxed, shall we? Grab my knife here. Let's not waste any time. Wait, you want to be in the video too? Wait, hold on. There you go. I haven't opened it yet. What do you mean, what did I get? I haven't opened it yet. A little impatient, are we? Be very careful, you do not want to play with knives. Very dangerous. Okay, here we go. Very nice presentation right here. So let's see what this thing has here. Ooh, I haven't seen this box in a long time. Controller Chaos. Pull this away. Okay. We do not need that. So this is the box right here. Uh, these guys, I've actually purchased um things from these guys before keeping it customized adding your personal touch and bringing your style to life is what sets apart this custom controller individually handcrafted just for you i've been waiting a very long time for this elevate your game controller chaos they're their um uh network social networks if you want to follow them there's facebook twitter youtube and Instagram. Okay. So let's go. Ooh, we got two Wii's. Um, Wii's. Psh, switches. <laughs> we got a Pro Controller for the Switch. We got a GameCube controller, a PlayStation, an Xbox controller, and a Joy-Con controller. Um, it's very hard to pick up on camera, but trust me, that's what they look like. So let's go. Let's not waste any time here. Refractor, this is gonna be so cool. You're gonna like this controller. What's your favorite color, by the way? Purple. Okay, sure, why not? Okay, we don't need this anymore. So first things first, we're gonna get this out of the way. It comes with a cable here. It comes with a charging cable, which I'm so glad they added. lengthy actually and this is the USB port so you could um, the USB plug so you could uh, plug it into the Nintendo switch so I'm glad they added that that's cool now we get on to the actual controller and it looks like this That's awesome. So let's go. Let's unbox this. Ooh, a matte finish. Ooh, I did not expect that. I thought this was, um, I thought this was glossy. It's a matte finish. That looks so good. The black and red. I love the black and red color combination. And it has my name on the back too. That 
That's so cool. It feels good in the hands. Nice. I can't wait to start playing some Super Mario Maker. <laughs> can't wait to start playing Mario Maker with this. This is going to be so cool. Also for uh, you guys that like ASMR. Wow. That looks great. It feels good too. So, um, obviously, I decided to go with my favorite color, uh, red. But uh, I also decided to give it a kind of a Shadow the Hedgehog aesthetic looking thing uh, look. So, I went with the black. And I think the black really contradicts the red, too. It, it, it really um, brings out the red uh, and everything. It makes the red look brighter than it actually is considering that this entire controller is uh you know it has like a matte finish so really cool including the embossed low um my name embossed there so that's pretty cool the buttons pretty clicky um not as clicky as an xbox one controller which i will actually bring out here in a second so you guys can get a comparison of how big this controller is yeah, not as clicky. Thumbsticks, awesome. Uh, I wonder, you know what I, I'm really curious to see? So this is the screenshot button, home button, pause, and, you know, the plus and minus button. But uh, I'm hoping to see if this actually has um, Amiibo support. Because on a real Pro Controller, the Amiibo support is on the, I think it's on the right stick? I think, I'm not sure. Uh, but I'm sure this thing has Amiibo support. It should. We'll see in a second. But for comparison, we'll bring in... Yeah, I'm sure it has Amiibo support. Excuse me, Refractor. I'll bring you out and I'll bring you back in just a second. So uh, we're going to compare this to a uh, Joy-Con grip. Because I know you guys like uh, comparing videos. So this is the Pro Controller next to the Joy-Con grip, and the Joy-Con grip feels, compared to the Pro Controller, some people prefer the Joy-Con grip, others prefer the Pro Controller, but to me, I think the Pro Controller, after, you know, holding it in my hands, it feels way better than a Joy-Con grip. Because the Joy-Con grip feels like you're kind of gripping a square, you know what I mean? It, it's, it kind of gets uncomfortable and it, it hurts your hands after a while. Let me fixate the camera a bit. There you go. Whoop. There you go. So it kind of like, it rests on your uh, middle finger and it kind of hurts a bit. Sorry about that, that was my dog. Yeah, so. But with this, it just feels like a better controller all around. It, it, it feels great to hold in the hands and it, and it doesn't uh, cramp up your, um, the side of your middle finger when holding it. Looks nice, feels nice too. Uh, here it is compared to a PlayStation 4 controller. And of course I have the uh, Spider-Man PS4 controller. So you guys can get a size comparison there. Okay. Uh, next we got a PS3 controller and this one is also a custom by Controller Chaos that they sent me. Give me one second. I'll be right back. Okay, back. <laughs> Sorry about that cut. But anyway, this is the other uh, pro um, PS3 controller that uh, Controller Chaos sent me. So you guys could get a size comparison there with the uh, Switch Pro controller. Also the back.
pretty cool. Okay. And finally we get to the Xbox One. Now this controller, uh, I've made an I've made an unboxing of this controller, uh, boxing review, whatever, of this controller already. So uh, I'll leave a link uh, down below where you can where you can actually um, find this video. But uh, this was not from Controller Chaos. This was actually from Microsoft themselves. So you guys can get a size comparison there. with the uh, Green Ranger controller. <laughs> yeah, that's what I based this off of. In the back. Pretty cool. So there you have it. So again, um, thanks to Controller Chaos. This is not a sponsored video, by the way. <laughs> but uh, yeah, thank you so much, Controller Chaos, for sending me this controller. And uh, I'll give this uh, controller a couple, um, a few days. I'll play with this controller a couple days, like Mario Maker. I've been playing Mario Maker 2 on the Switch for a while, so uh, it'd be interesting to play with a pro controller. So that's one of the main reasons why I bought a Pro Controller. Also, it really feels great to play uh, Super Smash Bros. Because as much as I love the Joy-Cons, I don't know. It, it just feels better holding a con uh, an actual controller in your hand. So I don't know. It just feels good in the hands. So. But yeah, that was an unboxing of my custom Pro Controller. Uh, from controller chaos and like i said i will leave a link down below so you guys can make your own controllers from controller chaos so there you go also i'm wondering if they sent me anything else no not really no they haven't sent me anything else it's just a plain box Yeah, they haven't sent me anything else other than the uh, controller and the cable. But either way, uh, I like I said, I'll leave a link down below where you guys can uh, go to Controller Chaos and make your own custom controller. Thank you so much, Controller Chaos. You guys are awesome. So, so there you go. That was my unboxing and kind of mini review of my custom Controller Chaos Uh Switch Pro Controller. So, Refractor, come back here. You got anything else you want to add? Maybe your thoughts on this controller? Of course you... Uh, of course. Of course you would have chosen those colors. You are those colors. Whatever, dude. And this King Vita saying, Laters.